happy sunday everybody and welcome back to my channel i'm nancy and i got brave today and went back to target um i if you didn't see my video from yesterday i did go to target and i picked up four summer tops um one of them i was really on the fence about when i taped it yesterday um but it was just really i really really loved it but it just seemed like it was really big here in the in the armholes was stretchy and I just wondered, should I take it back and exchange it for a medium, or should I just let it go and keep it? Um, the other one that I was on the fence about was the uh, a light green one from yesterday that was really so pretty on the hanger, and I wore it um, when I came home. I put it on, and it was still kind of cutesy, um, but it just, the color just totally, maybe it just washed me out. I didn't think it was flattering, but, but maybe it was. You know, sometimes it's really hard to judge for yourself. I think that's why, you know, I liked um, the option of going with um, the mix and match box and stitch fix because it's somebody else picking things to me, knowing what my shape looks like and um, my prep style preferences, but still give me their input on what they think would look good on me. Otherwise, it's like pick and choose for yourself and you're still no better off than you were because you don't know if it looks good on you or not. So anyway, I did go back. I just had the intention of going back and um, returning the green one and exchanging the other one for a smaller size, but oops, I accidentally bought four more tops. Um, I did um, get some salad stuff, so I did try to even it out a bit. So anyway, Target, here I come. Um, the first one in the bag, and again, everything that I bought um, today, the four tops, they're all machine washable, gentle cycle. They're all tumble dry low. Probably little to no ironing. This first one is kind of cute, even though I, I took back the one that washed me out the most. And what did I get? Another beige one. Um, so anyway, this one's uh, got some pretty florals in it. It's uh, like navy. There's like an olive green and blue. So I thought this might be perfect to wear with, with uh, dark wash blue jeans. I love this crotch shade detail along the neckline continues on down the chest and then around to the sides back it's just slip on so there's no buttonhole the crochet detail continues down uh, and it's probably going to fall right around my natural waistline um, it looks like it's a little bit of gathered right here and again in, in the front a little bit so it's going to maybe flare out a bit uh, maybe not a lot Hoping that maybe with um, this navy blue here, maybe it won't wash me out as bad. But um, anyway, we'll give this a try. I didn't try everything, anything on again. Like I said, I'm just, um, I, I don't do well in stores by myself. Um, I just get anxiety or panic attacks, and I just want to get in and out. Don't make eye contact with anybody if I can help it, which isn't very nice I, I know because sometimes I bumped into people and it's like I didn't even know they were there and they have to kind of shake me and Nancy I've been saying hello to you so anyway anyway so this is the first one hoping that will look uh, good with jeans and I did size down on everything on a medium um, don't know if that was the right choice or not I think I'm in between sizes I mean a couple of months ago I was an XXL and now I'm not quite sure I'm still in a larger if I'm just getting ready to go into a medium um, so I guess we will see these are all mediums this is the one that I exchanged that I had the large yesterday and around the armholes it just looked weird and this one I love the colors in it it's got you know like lime green it's got light blue it's got pink it's got yellow some little coral uh, around the sleeves it's got this beautiful crochet detail in the front and the back and then um, right at the armhole I can show you it's got this V right here to go up a little bit under the arms hoping that maybe hides a little bit under the arm so maybe as much as the bras don't show um, it's got the piping along the front line uh, so a little bit of contrast going in the opposite direction which is carried to the back um, it buttons all the way down the front which has got hidden um, in this panel right here the buttons are kind of like an iridescent. Don't know if the buttons are gonna show up, but they're kind of shiny, a little bit iridescent. I don't think my camera's gonna pick it up. And uh, that crochet detail goes down the front. 
all the way. The front um, is just a probably a rayon polyester blend, so there's no give in it at all. The back is solid black. It's like a jersey, silky material, and I need give, so it should work good for if you need to stretch or reach for something without uh, ripping it open. So anyway, hoping that this medium fits uh, a little bit better than the large. Um, I think even if it's a little tight where I've, I'm still losing and still working out, not a lot, but a little, maybe within the next few weeks it might fit a little bit better. This one, I looked at it, I put it back on the rack, I looked at it, put it back on the rack. Anyway, I ended up getting it. So again, it's another black floral. This one, the print is different, so there's white, there's pink, it's a lighter shade of green, more like a sage green, a little bit of light blue. Um, again, the fabric, there's no give in the front. The back is a solid back. It's got the keyhole with the button. Um, it's gathered at the waist, front and back, so hopefully it might give me a little bit of a shape. And the back um, is that jersey material, so this is going to stretch. So hopefully that'll be comfortable and fit, or close to fitting. And the last one. Um, it's something that I usually don't buy. Um, so anyway, um, it's another black print. Um, I think the black doesn't wash me out as much. Maybe that's what makes me drawn to it. It's got different uh, piping material um, along the arms, along the neckline, across the back, and the keyhole with the button front. Um, it's not really too much given this material. I mean, yeah, I would say no. No give it all on this material. Um, again, I got a medium, so hoping for the best because I really don't want to go back because I'm going to spend more money if I go back and exchange things and I'm out of control lately. Um, so anyway, this is the bottom of the, of the uh, top, which I usually don't go to get little flare things of hip because I really don't want to draw attention there, but I thought it looked kind of cute. Um, I like the red in it, and my reason for liking the red is I the other night when I uh, lost control on QVC uh, for the air shoes, I bought some red red ones. So I think that's what also drew me to this because I would bring off the red in those shoes. Um, again, it's a medium. Not quite sure if it's going to fit, but um, anyway, hoping it does. And I will try these on and I should be right back. Alrighty, and I am back with the first blouse and um, I really like this crochet detail around the neckline. I think that's going to help. Maybe I can't figure out how to put my necklace centered again. Um, I really think this will help make not make me look as washed out as if it wasn't there. It would have been nice if they had that same kind of detail right here. I think that would have really helped uh, with the looks of this. Um, anyway, it does go um, get the embroidery here under the chest and then around the back. So it's pretty much, I would say, right above my natural waistline. Um, it does flare out just a little bit. Um, I've got the dock wash jeans on today. These are actually from um, Mix and Match. Um, they're the Liverpool Sienna, the pull-on jeans. I originally got these in a 12, and I sized down to a 10. Um, and as you see, I, I am short, so they really bunch up here. Um, but I'm afraid if I ask for a petite, then it's not going to fit between the waist and the hip. So, um, but anyway, that's that one. Um, really can't tell. I, I, you know, I'm looking at it and I like the detail of the blue here, um, but not sure if it's washes me out too much or, you know, if maybe having this on or whatever will, will help so I don't look so washed out. Um, just let me know, let me know your opinion on this if you think the color looks okay or the style looks okay. I, I know this is like from the racks that the teenagers are all all getting, but it's like um, it's hard to shop for your age sometimes in stores where I don't know if I looked at for my age thing it's going to be sweatshirts and just things that I'm not quite ready to do um, all the time. I like I said in my, my first few videos um, I'm in my 60s. I want to look young. I want to feel vibrant. Um, I don't want to look like a teenager, um, but I just want to look like I'm vibrant. I'm alive. And that's, I don't know, I suppose everybody wants that. And 
we don't quite know how to get there. So anyway, I'm going to go try something else on instead of boring you with my life. And I am back with the shirt that I had the large in yesterday and exchanged for a medium. And I probably should have just been happy with the large. Um, the sleeves still do that same thing, so maybe that's just how the style goes. Um, I like how they have that material right there. Of course, you can still see my bra, so I'll have to wear a black one with it or, or a camisole over it. Um, don't know if you can see. I know I tried to get that button to show you that it's kind of iridescent, but I don't know if it's going to show or not. But that's the only button that shows, the one at the top. Um, it does bulge right here, um, so that's why I said I probably should have stuck with the large. Um, it's more form-fitting than the large was. Probably doesn't go down as low. Maybe I lost an inch or so in it. I think I liked it better with the uh, the light wash jeans that I had on yesterday instead of the dark. Um, the back is just that solid black and again it is a little stretchy so you know it's going to give a little bit other than right here. Um, and it's not that I'm, I've got a big chest, I don't. Um, so I'm, maybe I do have broad shoulders and that's what's pulling it or maybe I should have stuck with the large. Um, let me know what you think. I mean I really like this, this top. Um, I love the colors, I love the details, just not sure on the fit. Um, let me know what you think, if I should uh, be brave, go back and return it for the, the large, or if I should just work extra hard the next couple of weeks and make this one fit. I will be back with the next one. And I'm back with the third one. This is the uh, the other floral one that I got with the super, different colors in it. It's got the uh, gathering the elastic at the waist so I thought it might give me much a little bit of a waistline um, usually I would stay away from something like this because I don't want to draw any more attention to my hips um, I think if I had a real waistline um, and it went in a lot more then this would stick out more where I'm pretty straight um, sorry to say um, maybe it doesn't look as bad but still gives me the illusion of a figure Again, the back is just solid black. This is stretchy, so we're just going to stretch across the back. Um, again, it's just with my dark jeans on. I'm not sure if light jeans will look good, or you know, I, I did ask both um, stitch fix and mix and match um, to um, get some white jeans. So we'll see if maybe I've got some white jeans in my fixes this week. Um, so maybe that'll go nice with it. Huh? If not, I still wear my black yoga pants to work that I, I wore at home all the time. So I guess it would still go with them too, with where it's black. Um, let me know what you think this style, if it does, um, this peplum style, I guess, if it does really make my hips stand out more than they should, or more than anybody in their right mind wants to have them stick out, or if you think that it looks okay. Um, anyway, got one more to do, and I will be back. Alrighty, and last shirt, I promise. Uh, so anyway, this is the one. I, I got a medium. I really think this one probably could have gone to a large. Not that I need it across the chest or even the hips. I think just in, in the length. I think a large in the length would have fit much better. Don't know what it would have done uh, across the top or whatever. Um, this is another kind of style that I've always stayed away from because I didn't want to draw attention to my hips. I think I just really fell in love with the red hair because I, I got those red shoes the other night that I'm waiting for they come in next week or two weeks. And I just thought that would look nice with the red shoes. Um, anyway, it's, it is kind of an odd style, I think, because it is kind of short. Um, it, I mean, I think that the fit is okay, you know, just other than the length. And of course, I would have to wear black under it, not beige. Um, but anyway, uh, let me know what you think on this one. If, like I said, I think the fit of, around the arms is okay, across the chest, and, and even the hips, it's not tight. Um, it, it's just the length, or maybe that's the way it's supposed to be, that length. Um, anyway, um, I don't really want to go back to Target to return anything, but um, let me know your thoughts, and I will definitely uh, think about returning this or, or maybe even exchanging that other one to go back to a large. I think just being in between sizes uh, really makes it hard 
to choose what's the right one for you. And of course, if you're looking for something and I bought it just because it had the red here, it's going to be more red shirts that would go with my shoes. So anyway, let me know your thoughts. Um, as again, I've got big stitch fix coming on Monday and mix and match on Tuesday. So I can't wait to uh, open those boxes and show them with you, share them with you and, and hopefully get your thoughts and uh, look forward to watching all your videos as well. I get so much inspiration um, from looking at other people's uh, clothes, what they get to know what I should ask for or know what I should look for. Or I see someone says, oh, they kind of, like I would never think that I could wear the white pants and I've seen so many people posting lately with the white pants and they all look fantastic no matter if they're tall or short or my size or smaller so I mean that's the only reason I asked for them otherwise I never would have but I've just been inspired by so many great videos out there that it's like maybe I'm time to take the plunge I've never owned a pair um, so looking forward to see what I get this week anyway hope your rest of your weekend goes well and your work week flies by thanks again for watching see you soon